Hey guys, so in honor of the free update Legends for Ghost of Tsushima, I'm playing through a few of the mythical quests. Last time we ran through the Curse of Uchitsune. This time, I'm going for the Armor of Tadayori. The two bows that you get in the game are maximized with the Armor of Tadayori by increasing knocking speed and concentration perks. This armor can complete the Ranger build and also looks pretty good. Someday we'll go for a peaceful ride. The storyteller Yamato can be found in the rustling bend in Azamo, giving hope to the people. And now, I have a tale to lift our tired spirits. Centuries ago, the warrior, Tadayo, saved Azamo Bay from pirates. My lord, please join me. Sounds like you have an interesting tale to tell, but I'm surprised to find you in Azamo. We both go where we're needed, Lord Sakai. My story is for your ears as well. Centuries ago, Tadayori Nagao was the greatest archer on our island, famed for his wisdom and perfect aim. The Kami Hachiman himself was so impressed, he gave the archer his armor Light and strong beyond compare. The little writing about Tadayori that survives refers to a violet crown, a place in the north of Azamo, strewn with violet chrysanthemums, where Tadayori would often meditate. Driving the Mongols from our home is all I care about. This armor could help, if it's as good as you say. His armor is without equal, my lord. And I believe it is still out there. Find the Violet Crown. There is a Mongol camp along the way, and I do need stance progress. Landing, but useful.
Negium Harsinta! Huh? Ten
violet chrysanthemums will show you the way to the violet crown. Violet chrysanthemums. The musician who told me the legend of Tadayuri mentioned them. It could lead to the violet crown. Draw your blades! Violet crown. Tadayori's armor could be here. Incense. Burned recently. Something inside that container. A map to Tadayori's rest. A drawing is hung nearby the altar of Tadayori. A lot like what happened with Uchitsune. Seems to be a lot of bandits in the woods around here. Someone there? Look this way. Get down! <laughs> in circles for a bit, I finally see more violet flowers. More violet chrysanthemums. Tadayuri's rest could be close. are too sheer to climb. There must be another way in.
Just like the first location, someone else had gotten here first. Mongols. How did they find this place? A map. Like the one from the Violet Crown. Tadayori's vest. What are you doing here? Leave this place! I'm not here to fight. I am Jin Sakai, nephew of Lord Shimura. You're a liar and a thief! Defend yourself! I don't want to kill you. Stop! How dare you trespass on Tadayori! You dis you dishonor Tadayori's legacy, thief! We should be fighting Mongols, not each other. You're nothing but a dirty scavenger! It's not possible! You know how to use that stolen beast. My lord, my name is Kaede, last of Tadayori's line. After the woman Kaede realizes that you're not there to steal anything, and you actually are a samurai, she lets you know that there's a line from some scroll that she read that says her ancestor Tadayori would always be looking over Azamo. Azimo Bay turns out to be a fortress at this point, but there is a way onto the overlook right next to it. The violet flowers are on this mountain, and it looks like the Mongols are already here. Chrysanthemums. We have the musician. Go! 
My lord, how did you find us? A descendant of Tadayori pointed me here. What happened to you? A Mongol spy found a long-forgotten scroll written by Tadayori's firstborn. They forced me to decipher it, and it led us here. So they found the armor? No. I misdirected them, hoping you'd reach us in time. You took a big risk. And it paid off. The armor is hidden beneath this memorial. Claim it for yourself, my lord. A memorial to Tadayori. Artistry is incredible. Stay back, musician. I won't let the Mongols near you. Yes, my lord. That was like watching Tadayori himself. The armor is perfect for an archer. My tale found the right audience. And now it's time for me to move on, my lord. After dealing with an annoying number of archers, the Mongol raiders are finally defeated. Tadayori's armor isn't just nice to look at, but it also helps with speed and concentration when using a bow. You can deal with multiple enemies from afar in rapid succession, and headshots reward concentration return, the ability that slows time so you can line up better shots. So that's it for this one. This was the second video of Mythical Quest in Ghost of Tsushima, and I have so much fun playing this game I'll probably do some more.
If you guys think there's a way that they could be done differently, or there's something you'd like to see in these videos, please let me know in the comments below. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video or thought it was interesting, please like and subscribe. Enjoy another visit to my favorite person in Tsushima.